Tyler Bonnick here with UCCS Athletics, here with head coach Chris Yeller of the UCCS volleyball team. Now, coach, after going 2-0 and last weekend, how are you really going to ride that momentum coming into this weekend? You know, we're just trying to keep the energy. Um, we're, we're trying at practice. We're at a point in the season where, you know, things get a little slow and um, frustrating and they're tired and classes are going. Um, but we're trying in practice. So if we can keep that momentum and keep the energy at practice, I think we'll be okay this weekend. And like you said, you know, it's that time of the year, the fatigue really playing a factor. How do you keep things lively in practice? You know, are you guys a little more, you know, having fun? What do you do in practice to keep the energy up? You know, it's just a mentality. We're, we're trying as a staff to, to try and help them, but it's it's really up to them. They have to come in every day and, and want to be there. Um, and they, they've done a really good job at that. So um, I'm not disappointed at all. It's just one of those things that you have to make an effort to do. And now this weekend, you guys are back on the road for Western State and then Colorado Mesa. The next two weekends, you guys are back on the road. So really, is that going to play a factor going on the road for the next two weekends and then going into playoffs? Um, it does. If we can do a good job on the road the next two weekends, um, we'll have a really good shot at hosting um, for the first round of the RMAC tournament. So, you know, it, it gives us something to look forward to. And going on the road's not easy, but having that to look forward to really, really helps. And like you said, right now, you guys are fifth in the seating. If playoffs started today, you guys wouldn't have home court advantage. So how nice would it ha be to have home court advantage? And especially against Colorado Mesa, who's above you guys right now, how nice would it, um, is there any more pressure on that game to uh, get this home court advantage? You know, I don't know about that game as much as every other game. I think for us, if we win out, we'll have a really good shot at hosting. So um, we're going game by game. So the first game on Friday will be the most important game for us. And then Saturday night, that'll be the most important game. So we're just kind of playing it day by day. And looking at that Western State game, I know you've been talking about, you know, situational stuff in practice and really focusing on what you guys are doing. What have you guys been working on in practice to really make sure that you guys are ready for this weekend? Just keeping the energy. I mean, really on our side, if we can come out and play hard and, and keep that energy, it's going to be hard hard for another team. So um, that's what we're really, really focused on. Of course, we're also focused on what the other teams do well. And you guys have been all over uh, the road this year, especially only having uh, four home weekends. So is it getting used to going on the road and getting in that routine? And do you guys really have a routine going on the road now? You know, we've done a really good job on the road. So um, I'm not super stoked about being on the road, but with this team, um, I think they've done a really good job of proving themselves in the RMAC on the road. So um, it's not super worrisome. The two teams that we're playing this weekend are really tough, and that I think is the, the hardest part of it is um, we've got to show up, not only show up, but show up for their teams. And just looking at the other teams, first off for Western State, really what is going to be the biggest factor? What do you guys need to really stop for them to have a victory on that uh, match? Um, you know, we got to take them out of their ball control. If we can serve tough um, and really attack them, I think we'll do a really good job. Um, if we allow them to pass, they run a really great offense. So um, if we allow them to have good ball control, I mean, it will be tough for us to win that match. But if we can take them out of their offense, it, it'll be a little bit easier. And for Colorado Mesa, a heavy hitting team, really one of those that are attacking at the net. Really, how do you control that? And what do you tell your girls when you know this team is very heavy hitters? When you're that aggressive, we've got to be aggressive defensively. Um, and you've heard the cliche numerous times, defense wins games. So um, if we can take Western out of their offense, um, we're hoping to do that again on Saturday night and take Mesa out of theirs and play some really heavy defense. Well, there you have it. Head coach Chris Yeller of your UCS volleyball team taking on Western State and then Colorado Mesa on the road. Coach, good luck. Thanks, Charlie.